Sorry about the melodramatic ending last time, but this little guy made quite the entrance. I think I'll keep him. After that brick came sailing through my kitchen window last night, I heroically sprang to action and apprehended the brick-throwing villain. Don't believe me? <laughs> or I ran out the front door and tripped over some bushes. That girl you heard had to been on a bike. Or maybe she was a track star. Or maybe she just lives nearby. What is certain is that somebody's trying to send me a message and my mental map of the front yard is completely inaccurate. So, here to help us unpack what happened. You have to house. You keep, people can't see you if you're standing all the way over there. I didn't know you were ready for me, Mr. Marshall. Right, but I was giving you the cue. I was like, <clears throat> okay, so we are two thirds of the way to winning this game of Clue. We have the weapon. We know it came through the kitchen window. Now we just need the who. As I've said already, I don't know the people from town very well. Okay, but I don't know them at all, so this is a good start. Yes, of course. Have you noticed anybody suspicious lurking around? Anybody that shouldn't be here day, night? I, uh, no. No, I haven't. Who knows I'm here? Let's start with that. Practically everyone. News travels fast. Mm -hmm. You think there's anybody that wants to search the house? A search? Like, for a safe, or, you know, thinking there's valuables for the taking after my aunt's death. I don't pretend to know what others think may or may not be here. Well, what do you think? Your aunt was a woman of many secrets. At this point, <laughs> nothing would surprise me. Mm -hmm. How long have you worked for her? Several years. Several? Mm -hmm. Several like two or several like six? And... Four years, 11 months, three days, eight hours. Right. Okay. And... Got, we got it. Yep. It was a joke. Ah, accessing your synthetic humor package, I see. I'm not a robot. Well, I wouldn't go that far. At the very least, house, you're not. Uh, who was that? That was Mr. Morgan. Mr. Morgan? The Marshall House handyman. Okay, did you know he was going to be here? Yes. I asked him to replace screens and several... Second floor windows. Mm, is that right? Is something wrong? Ah, uh, gee, I don't know how somebody threw a brick through my window last night. I would love to know when people are going to be here. <laughs> yes, of course. Mr. Pickering brought him on to uh, oversee all of the house repairs. Arthur hired him? Yes. Are there any cameras on the property? None, Mr. Marshall. Hmm. Well, thank you, House, for your valuable time. You've been extremely helpful. <clears throat> or have you been questionable? Oh, come on, I have to suspect him. He's a butler. He hasn't exactly been forthcoming either. In any case, we are no closer to figuring out who threw this little gem through my kitchen window, and this town hasn't exactly been welcoming. What is clear, though, is that my theory about something being hidden in this house is not that far-fetched. I have a feeling this is going to be a very long year. Mm -hmm.